everybody, it is I, Mr. Charlie Murray, and welcome back to the Jedi Knight episode 9, I think? Yes, I'm more confident of it being episode 9 than episode 10. I didn't think to check because I'm an idiot, as you are well aware. So last time we met Hair Ren, I think that's how you say her name, and the Jawa Brick, and told me that powerful Sith destroyed their guard droids, Toss sold a shock drum and took Master Quick's hostage. Oh no. They can trace the sound, but they need me to go and reactivate the power. So let's do that. Actually, no. Before we do that, I just wanted to buy a decoration pack because I had some spare cartel coins before whenever the pack comes out. Uh, whenever the pack does come out, but I should say. Oh, I need to claim it. So should we just see what I get? Because, mm, why not? i got money to burn. So let's see. Let's see. Do I get anything nice? Do I get anything nice? I get... Something I've already got. The Damaged Republic ATV. Already have it, but I can sell it. Woo! Right, let's go. Uh, right, where are we actually going? We need to go past the sand people. Can we actually... No, oh, worth a shot. You know what, Kira? I think I'll actually got to change you to a DPS. Because, of course, sure, healing is nice. But it takes forever for the battle to finish. And, well... They're not really doing much damage to me anyway. Or oh, actually the right level for Tatooine. Ah, how about that? Hasn't had to downscale me, upscale me, downscale, downscale. Yes. Yes, downscale. Yes, that's what I tried to say. Everyone's dead. Cool. Aw. Aw. Look at the way it just sort of struggled to get up and then died. <laughs> I feel so sad. Oh, of course. There'll be sand people in my way, so I have to go and kill them. Early. Ooh, sand people coming from the ground, are they? Well, you cheeky sand people. Oh yeah, that was a stability, wasn't there? Zedus Ooh, whoa! That just killed you instantaneously. And we kill you guys. More well, sand people coming from the ground. How are you breathing? Well, actually, no, I guess that's what your masks are. But where are you getting oxygen from? Oh no! Sacrifice! Sorry, Kira. I had to sacrifice you because I took you off healing, didn't I? Because I'm an idiot. But hey, I shall heal myself up now, and then I shall... Reactivate the generator. Oh, I thought I was healing myself up. There we go. Now you're healing myself up. And I haven't got my buffs up. Of course I haven't. Uh, right. First one. Done. Second one. Done. And the last one. Done. Return to seismologist Heron. Alright. You know what? Screw you. I wanted to do that. Ooh, that killed them all instantaneously. Ah, oh, that's lovely. Well, you know, death isn't lovely, but that's lovely. Guess who's back? Back again. To see your weird family. Facility power is back online. I'm afraid that's the only good news I have. Oh, wait. I just realized I need to turn the voice up, don't I? Because I did a PvK video, and the voices are down. There we go. You can hear them a lot better now. Facility power is back online. I'm afraid that's the only good news I have. I just detected the shock drum's locator beacon. The weapon has been activated. Uh-oh. Don't shut it down. The device will soon reach critical mass. When it does, Tatooine's core will explode. No, it Don't won't. Boom, boom! Don't Exploding bricks homeworld. This is not happening. It won't destroy Tatooine. Know why? Because Tatooine is still there in the movies. Why isn't the Sith deploying the shock drum someplace populated, like Coruscant? Tatooine may not be a core world, but there are still many innocent lives in danger. Pinpointing the shock drum's exact location from here is impossible. The seismic vibrations disrupt our sensors. The general region is thousands of square kilometers. We have to narrow it down somehow. Maybe ultrasonic scanners finding Boom Boom? That's brilliant! The ultrasonic scanners, of course! Uh, explain. If your sensors are useless, what good will scanners be? Ultrasonic scanners read seismic disruptions in the ground and trace them to their source. Ultrasonic scanners placed in a wide pattern will triangulate the shock drum's seismic disturbances. They'll reveal its location. Yeah, and yeah. scanners is extremely dangerous. The desert region is deadly. Ideally, we'd send an army. I'm twice an army. Brick repairing with droids, Jedi and Heron have army. The droids won't be ready soon enough, Brick. This Jedi is our only hope. I am I feel indeed. Master Kuwik's reaching out to me. Something terrible is happening to her. She's as good as dead. The odds we'll find her alive aren't even worth considering. 
If you're trying to prepare me for the worst, cut it out. Take the ultrasonic scanners. Place them at these map coordinates. We'll contact you by hollow once we've triangulated the shock drum's location. Good luck. Well, someone's got to prepare you, Kira, because seriously, why am I gaining influence from you, Kira? Somebody said to me last week that even though you, they could really, really, really hate you for the stuff that you say, you'll still gain influence. That is the most stupidest system that could have ever been created. I mean, sure, sure, companion guests can just fix all that, but that is just absolutely stupid. Right, I need to go there, there, and there. Can I, can I jump over? Mm -hmm, probably shouldn't risk that. Probably shouldn't risk jumping over. Um, um, um. Let's see if I can make my way around. Actually, I really should get on my mount. Might be a lot easier. I might be able to run away from enemies a lot quicker. Uh, first sensor goes here somewhere, I think. On this spot, roughly. Lovely! That's one sensor down and two more to go. Oh, look! It's Geonosians! Because everybody loved those from episode two, didn't they? Uh, um, 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 um. Just trying to see if I can get it as close to this area as possible without being seen. We should be good. About, about there. Yeah, it's close enough. Sure, there's no enemies around here, but eh, I just can't be bothered to go any further. And the last one needs to go directly that way. How about that? This is where the mission briefing tells me to go all the way back now. I'd prefer it if it didn't, but I get the feeling I may have to. Oh, little droid all on its own. Oh, usual. Oh, okay, thank you. I was worried for a second there. I placed the scanners. Do you have a fix on the shock drum? Collating the scanner readings now. Ah, oh, no wonder the sensors couldn't find it. It's beneath an abandoned mining complex. I'm sending the coordinates and the shock drum's deactivation code. Everything depends on you now, but we'll be here if you need us. Uh, no, it's too risky. Evacuate. No, Kashila doesn't care. Unless you're planning to invade that mining complex, you aren't much use to me. Rick completed repairs to his droids. We'll try to have them meet you there. Ah, oh, lovely. See you again. Heron out. Greetings, Jedi. Oh. I am Lord Praven. My master seeks retribution for his son's death. I must give it to him. Easier said than done. Lord Sadik tried to kill me on Nar Shadda. He's dead now. An admirable victory. Assuming you achieved it honorably. <laughs> when my master learned you were here, he demanded I activate the shock drum. You'll destroy this entire world. No, you won't. I know you've located the weapon, but that won't be enough. I changed the deactivation code. Surprise, surprise. Lightsabers can deactivate just about anything. The shock drum is ray shielded. Entering the proper code is the only way. Come, face me. If I win, I've done my duty. If you win, you'll have the new code. Whatever the outcome, we will battle with honor. I await you at these coordinates. Why do people do that? Coordinates. Why do people say that? I mean, Yuan was doing that as well in the Jedi Consular. Coordinates. I know it's spelled Nates, but just... Why Why do people say coordinates? Is that like the proper way of saying it? Because it's just... Ugh. Um, I've got an XP booster, that's fine, and I need to get in, ooh, increases, ma temporarily increases your maximum health by 30%, ooh, that's lovely, and that's the only ability that I have. Alright then, right, where are we actually going now? We are going, uh, there, okay, I haven't gone, hadn't gone to the Dune Sea yet, but how, I'm a bit concerned as to how I get... Over there, I guess I could go. I might as well just quick travel to the yeah this area and then just make my way around. All right, Raven, I'm here. Better just be you though, because ooh, blimey, that's a bright light. Bloody hell! Oh, is that so bright? Right, where are we going? Um. Oh, okay, so it's just like a little island then. All right, the shock drum doesn't look like it's here. Have you hidden it in a different place? How dare you? Unless it is really here, I don't really know. Where is he? He hasn't popped into existence just yet. Craven, Craven, there you are. There you are. Eh, uh, whatever.
Foe, foe, foe. I sense your power. Now I understand why Tarnis was no match for you. His death was my failure. I should have trained him better. The student died easily. I expect his teacher will too. Tarnis was young. He underestimated you. I won't. I welcome the end of your kind. The Jedi obsession with my people's extermination must end. Your lust for revenge will destroy this galaxy. Um, your, your lightsaber's going through your hat. Okay, anyway. Um, I highly doubt Force Persuade would work. Cause it's kind of not weak-minded, but I'll give it a shot anyway. You don't want this world to be destroyed. Help me save it. I don't want this world to be destroyed. I will help you save it. Now give me the code so I can deactivate the shock drum. I will give you the code to deactivate the shock drum. I also have other things you may find helpful. It worked? Wait. What have you done? I don't I know. I touched you with honor and you tricked me. How dare you? I didn't expect that to work. Your honor remains intact. You lost to a superior opponent. This battle has not yet begun. Come. Let us end this. Die well, Jedi. Die poorly, Sith. Broke moment, because, you know, cheating all. Ah, <sighs> Remember the days before heroic moments? Oh, my. It was a simpler time. Now it's just this and that and this and that. And force choke. Oh no, it's absorbing all my power, all the hit points. Oh no! What'd you do that for? And bomb. And dead. Lovely! Such skill. So much power. Impressive. Not really. You could be a great Sith if you embraced the dark side. I am! Give me a moment. The dark side is... Maybe I already have. Perhaps that's how I beat you. Then my defeat stings much less. Darth Angrel commanded me to destroy the shock drum code. He wanted you to die in failure, no matter the outcome here. I will not tarnish my honor with petty tricks. You've earned better. The code is yours. You already gave me it, but hey. If you think that will buy you mercy, guess again. A warrior never regrets death. Only dishonor. Darth Angrel ordered that Master Kuix suffer greatly before her death. I wish I had disobeyed that order as well. You expect me to believe you care what happens to a Jedi? She faced me as a warrior. She should die as one. I left her incapacitated next to your weapon. If they haven't already, the ultrasonic vibrations will eventually tear her apart. You scum! You should die like that! Wow. Nothing more Calm to down, say. Kira. You won our duel. Finish me. Uh with pleasure. Killing you will give me great satisfaction. Ha! Kira likes ready. that. May the force be with you. I love how my shadow appears in front of his body rather than behind. Yes. That was a bit weird, but hey, personal holocom! The Sith changed the deactivation code for the shock drum, but I have the new one. I'm on my way. You're not there yet? Rick and his family are in terrible danger. Surprise, they surprise. They followed their droids to the mining complex. I tried to stop them, but they were determined to help you. Rick just sent an emergency hollow. He says there's something called a sand demon at the mine. It's attacking them. The Sith hid your super weapon in the mine without this beast interfering. What changed? I don't know. Maybe the shock drum's vibrations enraged it, it, attracted it there. That beastly predator is the only thing that hunts crate dragons. And those are massive. Brick doesn't stand a chance. Please, you can't let anything happen to Brick and his family. Save them and stop the shock drum. Hurry! I thought you said he was technically your family at the same time. Now you're sort of acting like he's not. 
We are getting a bunch of crystals now. Ooh, rank four with Kira. Wonderful. Uh, how many crystals do I have? Do I have enough crystals to, uh, I don't know, get gear? Because, um, yeah, I don't know how I've survived this long. But anyway, I guess we're going into the Dune Sea now. Lovely, lovely. Oh, well, that's handy. Made my way to Outpost Tharazan, and it's literally outside it. So I'm surprised this place can't feel the vibrations of the shock drum right now. But, eh. I mean, yes, I know. Of course, this place isn't going to feel the vibrations of the shock drum because, well, story and all, it's meant to happen in, in the phase itself. As soon as I walk into the phase, the shock drum... Where'd you come... What? Where'd you come from? The shock drum will start to... Um, vibrate the place, but you know, it'd be a nice touch. Oh, oh, oh no, how am I gonna? Oh no, oh, how am I gonna get back up there? Um, uh, that should no, no, come on, there we go. That's a big bone. Oh my, that is a big tip. What the hell kind of creature was here on Tatooine? Bloody hell. Oh god, I'm stuck in a it's stuck in a crack. Step on a crack and you break your mother's back. <gasps> Brick! Hello! <laughs> boom boom making big hole on planet and Brick finding more something. Sand demon being here, destroying all Brick's droids. She's dead. Sand demon blocking way to shock drum. What Brick are you doing about it? Do whatever you want, but stay out from underfoot. You want to sing Sand Demon all for yourself? Brick happy staying here. After Sand Demon being dead, we help stop Boom Boom. If you being dead instead, then we all be dead. You fighting brave. Thanks, Brick. Well, hello, handsome. You okay? You, uh, enjoying your rest? Yes, it's, it's a nice place. Nice home you got here. But, um, it's kind of coming down. You might want to get out. Oh, you can't. Hmm. Why's that? Hmm. Oh well. Nice meeting you. Oh, oh, run away, run away. Bye bye. <laughs> Love doing that. As soon as they spawn, you just leg it and they don't see you. Uh, can I skip all of them? Oh, of course I can, because they're placed awkwardly. Unless I have to kill them. But I assume because they're a bonus mission, I don't need to. Right, where's the big sand demon? I believe that's you. And guess what? Heroic moments. Because why not? There we go, Sand Demon's dead. Ooh. Oh, I've already picked that up, but it likes to glitch. Right, where have I got to place the code? Uh, oh, don't tell me I've got to go up there. No, no, I don't. Um. Oh, come on! Oh, come on now. Yep, bye bye. Oh, hello, there's one here I've got to kill. Yeah, take that. And that. Now, this is pod racing. As Anakin would say in episode one. So now if Master Quix is right next to the shock drum, I would be quite surprised if she has survived. I can't remember if she survived or not, but I would be incredibly surprised if she did survive. Because, could you imagine? She's right next to it. And just, just, oh, it would pretty much crack your brain, I feel. I, I think it would crack your brain. And I would take that. Thank you very much. Uh, anything else? I could take that. Thank you very much. And I think that's all I can wear for now. Yes, that is all I can wear. Oh, right. actually, no. Ooh, no. Yeah, that's all I can wear. All right. Um. Oh, how'd you get it before me? You cheeky bastards. Right. Um. Um. This. This thing. Yeah. Shut down the shock drum. Done. And for some reason, it had the hyperspace sound. Quiet, finally. I can breathe again. I've been down here so long. How did you even survive? Master, let us help you. Kira and Orgus's Padawan. You're both changed. What has happened? I turned to the dark side. Darth Angrel wants to destroy the Republic. You're going to help me stop him. I am in no condition to face a Sith Lord. I only survived this weapon by withdrawing into a deep trance. The Force itself became my armor. Sustaining the trance cost me greatly. My strength is a fraction of what it was. I need the power to survive these conditions. 
Show me how you did it. Someday, when I am well enough to lead you through the trance, I know you face terrible dangers for me. I will not forget that. Here you are. I was coming to help when sensors indicated the shock drum stopped. You did it. Rick wasn't exaggerating about the sand demon. I've never seen anything like it. I've seen worse. One less nasty beast. It won't be missed. Sand demon eating many of Brick's relatives. My Brick friends, thinking Jedi something. The danger is not yet past. Even deactivated, that weapon remains a threat. You understand the situation best. What should we do? We need the shock drum. If we can get it out of here, this weapon could defeat the Empire. I'm sure General Varsuthra can move the shock drum somewhere the Sith won't find it. I'll have to go with it, Brick. Would you and your family enjoy seeing more of the galaxy? Brick's family following Heron anywhere. Exciting. I will see to the shock drum. You should return to your ship and inform General Varsuthra what's happened. I'm leaving you with a lot of responsibility. You'd better be up for it. I was a Jedi Master before you were born. I'll be fine. Before we go, you need to know something. And I'd rather you hear it from me. I never told you about my childhood. I'm not who you think I am. So much about you is now clear to me, Kira. But you're wrong about one thing. You are exactly who I think. A strong, capable young woman. One day, you'll be a great Jedi. I wish I shared your confidence. Maybe I should stay with Master Kowix? Go ahead. You're needed elsewhere, Kira. Consider impressing your new master with your final trial. We'll meet again on Tython. May the Force be with you. Use my ship's holo terminal. Okay, bye, Brick. Holo terminal, here I come. General, I've secured your shock drum prototype. Send a recovery team to pick it up. Along with seismologist Heron and Master Quix. Wonderful news. I have some thoughts for modifying the shock drum into an aerial bombardment device. I'll send a transport to Tatooine immediately. But don't get ahead of yourself, Doctor. Let's hope your mission to Alderaan goes as well as it did here. Marsuthra out. I was pretty sure we were going to have Brick as a companion. Um, I was pretty sure of that. What, was I wrong in that then? Oh. Um, or maybe I'm thinking of a different class. Um, oh, I am thinking of a different class. What class was I thinking of then? Oh, I was thinking of Blizz. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh. Oh. Okay. Well, that was episode 9, because I'm an idiot. Yeah, thanks for watching, people. And uh, I'll see you in the next episode when I'm not an idiot. But I'm an idiot every episode. And a farewell to you.